Hello everyone, welcome to another fucking adventure. It's me, Woki. I missed today, so that's a mess on my bad. I'm gonna try and make it up to you by uh, playing some Dokkan. I just got home from work, so I'm in a perfect mood to try out a, an event I've never played before. <laughs> Alright, let's go in. This is gonna be, uh, I guess, Merge some is gonna start. I did my summon, so I didn't get shit, so. Going to be I only had enough for one. And I don't really feel like summoning anymore because I feel like I'm gonna bring in some heavy duty stuff just in case. Um, I'm not summoning anymore because I feel like they already said there's gonna be a part two. And if there's gonna be a part two, then I have a feeling that they'll sneak in a um, step up banner. And if that happens, then I would much rather have a step up banner than have. Two new units I'm not going to really use all that much. It's just, uh, I don't have the teams for them. I do want that in my. If I had in my, I feel like I would care a little bit more, but I don't. So, here we are. Dokkan. So let's go in to Masu. Again, I don't really know what the gimmick is or anything. But I'm just trying it out. Um, I should be fine. Unless Dokkan has decided to make this much harder out of nowhere. Wouldn't that be hilarious? <laughs> um, that's not good. No, that's fine. Can I just get all my health back? Yeah. It's not too hard. I literally got all my health back. Uh, okay. Let's see. Uh, yeah, um, I'm gonna talk more about it in 2 release, but they're really strong. He says that, but I also feel like all they are is, are they're just updates. Which isn't bad, I guess, I don't know, man. I just feel like we've come to expect more adding units and for them to be... Actually, that's not true. I'm still trying to think of my thoughts. Also, it's really late at the morning, so maybe it's not the best time for me to start saying dumb shit that I'm not going to be able to back up. Everyone knows how I play Dokkan. It's to literally just sit back, relax, watch the cool animations, watch the Dane Dane Trio come in. And I feel like these two specifically are built pretty good, but I also feel like I want more, which is kind of fucked up because I feel like they're already kind of strong. But I don't really know why I want more, is what I'm saying. There's a, it's just an overarching feeling I have. I can't really explain it though. There we go. Uh, that okay. Yeah, I just don't know. It's uh, I hope the people who like Trunks and Zamasu are happy with the cards, because I think that's really what it comes down to. Is are the people who would play these two units happy with the units? Because let's be real here, it would never have mattered how good these guys were. Um, I just don't care that much about them. There was a point in my life where I did, and that was back when they came out two years ago. Back when I cared a little bit more about Dokkan and just having the strongest card. Now I'm just kind of with the mindset of like, yeah, sure, strong cards are fine, but if they're not a unit I like, then kind of who cares? And it's, an, it's a philosophy not a lot of people take, and I feel like to play gotcha this long, you'll play by the rules that you decide for yourself. So I never try and be like, this is the way to play Dokkan, because there is no way to play Dokkan, you see what I'm saying? So, hope I'm getting this one across pretty well. Uh, we're also almost done with this dude, so that's good. I'm not done done, but here. Oh wait, can I have tacked Zamasu this entire time? Uh, are they gonna do the the boner, the dick touch? Show the dick touch, cowards! Where the fuck was the dick touch? I don't watch Super, and I know for a fact they go dick to dick and then fuse. That's not fair. At least the card has the dick touch. I'm glad that the card was brave enough to include the dick touch. I'm gonna save uh, B pins special for one more turn. Uh, for the Dan Dan trio. Because Dan Dan is the finisher, as far as I'm concerned. Oh, she's doing a flip 
to get to the car. Now here's something annoying from what I remember the first time we did it. Um, ooh, excuse me, let me breathe. Um, he can super twice. Or at least that's what I remember his original event being like, which was kind of annoying back then. I think it's a little bit more manageable now, but... I wonder if he kept that gimmick, because that would really suck. So I remember back in the day, you really needed Trunks, and if you didn't get Trunks, then, well, congratulations, you just get fucked every other turn. But if you had Trunks, it was super easy to take down. But he was a joke, basically. Uh, same thing with Trunks, if you had actual units that you needed, he was stupid easy. But right now, I'm, I don't think I'm running any of the dudes that you need to beat him, and I'm doing perfectly fine. But it's gonna be the... the fucking strolling. Let me show you a true god. Wolf Bang God Fist. The cool bitch. Anyway, sorry for that story. Sorry for all the kids out there. I'll try and be better. You deserve a band better than just, than just randomly strolls. You deserve a man who uh, remembers to uh, not forget that he has a video coming up. <laughs> So, he doesn't release a video because he uh, got busy with work. So I can do better than that. Oh man, hands up, hands down. And then here comes the freak. 1-800-CALL-FREAK. Doing the freak. Shout out to my brother who loves to do the freak. Uh, actually, this is kind of shitty. And it's actually not that bad, now that I see it. Than I thought. It's gonna be really funny when it turns out I brought all those items for nothing. <laughs> oh wait, he's actually doing a shit ton of damage now. Uh oh. I'm on Terminator Eye. Oh no! Wow, what a fucking coward. Okay, now I might be in a little bit of trouble if he decides to swap again. Let's see. Let's see what happens. Watch me get fucked live. See, that time was better because I'm thinking a reference to the fact that uh, singles are in your area. Oh, he dodged. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, Giro, get it done. Dab on him, Giro. Damn. Dab. Okay. It's time to unleash the bee. Let me see, where are you strongest? You can hear the rooster calling in the background because it's almost daytime over here. Okay. I'm actually gonna use an item. I'll pay respects to Zamasu when you use an item. Yeah, I get it. It's almost daytime. Uh, yeah, that works. Aw, oh, damn it, I actually should have kept some rainbow work. Slap him across the face when you Also, I wanted to keep my health low so when Kid Goku comes in, he can actually just beat the shit out of Zamasu. Easy peasy, you know what I mean? Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Here comes the Dan Dan, hitting him with that special. I'm really glad that there's a booster in the background. Wow, we were really gonna go after the Dan Dan. I love that he's only been attacking people in groups. Not a lot of damage though. Oh, he healed. What an asshole. What kind of asshole heals? And now, excuse me, as I heal with my B pan. Crit? Yeah, crit. B crit. Oh fuck, now I, I can't do the Goku because B pan healed me too much. That's fine. Let's see. Yeah. Yeah, this will work out. I think he dies his turn. Let's find out, huh? How are you gonna heal? What kind of punk ass heals? Please kill him. I just realized that I actually don't have that much defense on my side. Kill! Kill! Damn it! Booster, shut up! Okay. Dead. Yeah, he's dead. So it ends with Kid Goku, just not the way I wanted it to. Not too bad. 
Um, it did require me to use an actual item, but I feel like I actually could have done fine with Bowman Ox King. So I give that fight a, uh, a 3 out of 5 big boy. Not the most challenging fight. Might be a bit of a motherfucker if it ever gets on a uh, boss rush. Hmm. I don't really think that far, far ahead, though. I can't think that far ahead. <laughs> and thank you, Roshi. And thank you, everyone, for watching the video. Hopefully, uh, I'm able to get this one and the other video up at the same time. Otherwise, uh, enjoy your day. And see me next time as I fight Trunks.